You missed a spot, Wyatt. There it is. Now we wait. Sarge, isn't this roar thing's really there? That's what they say. Well, that's what they say. That's what they say. What do you think, McKee? I don't know, Faraday. But I guess you're gonna tell me. See, the way I figured, we get atomic bombs, crowd's got V2s, Japs have gotta have something, too. We're here for the scientist. That is it. Hey. Able squad's ready, Sarge. Okay. Start the engine. Take us in. We're clear. Anyone hit? Able squad didn't make it, Sarge. Shit. All right. It's up to us, then. How come it ain't started yet, Sarge? They said 0600. Right on time. Hope it worked. The key. If they can take what we're throwing at them now, they can keep the defector. Let's get moving. Get him out of here. Hang on a second. What the hell is that sound? What's he saying? I don't, I don't know, sorry. If you sold us out. Yaminobuki. The black weapon. It started. We're dead, man. Okay. We're going, pal. It's no use. Maybe you didn't understand me. We are getting out of here. Sarge, they just cut off our primary. All right. We'll go through the sub pen. That's a goddamn death trap. Yeah, I know. Move it! 
get that goddamn hatch open. We made it. We made it. You see? I told you we'd make it, Wyatt. Russian territory to back up a U.S. counterintelligence operation. A simple support mission, they said. Nothing's ever really that simple, though. Is it? I can't believe you're leading us through another minefield, Haggett. You all are some stupid people. Hey, they're forming down there. Marlow. How much time? And off's in five. No problem. We're there in three. GPS is getting no strikes on our guy down there. Are you sure he's here, Sarge? Yeah, if HQ didn't fuck us with old intel. What are the odds of that? Whatever. We're almost clear. Annie up. That was fucking magic, Sarge. You got my back for real. You don't die on my last mission. Marlo, you got point. Our guy's gonna be out there all alone if we don't hurry up. Let's go. Scope. Archangel, this is Bravo 2. I got eyes on vehicle and possible HVT subject. Copy that, too. No, no, oh shit! You fucking. Archangel, requesting kill on subject ASAP. Sarge? Archangel, he's mobile. Bravo 2 actual, hold your fire. Hold your fire. I had him! We let that piece of shit go! You ain't got shit on no one unless I see you do. Simmer the fuck down. Your time will come. Archangel, subject is gone. Vehicle is still present. Bravo 2 Actual, the town has been declared hostile. Secure the vehicle. That's a solid copy, Archangel. Out. You heard the man. Y'all still with me? Hags? 
Yeah. Sweet one. This is interesting. It's a fake what you found. Fake, sir? A dummy. We think it's a dry run. For what exactly, sir? They're building a weapon. What we know about it so far scares the shit out of us. What we don't know scares us a lot more. So we need more intel. We need it last week. That's where you... Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Listen, I need this done ricky-tick. I got nine other units and shit so deep they've forgotten what the sun looks like. So, you work for us now. We want you to do what you do best. Be unorthodox. Be lethal. If you do that, you can go home. All of you can go home. Sir, what, what do you mean, home? Uh, home? Home, sir? Yep. Can you do that for me? We can do that, sir. Now, this object you found, we got an asset in Bolivia. This is his specialty. Name's Aguirre. Give him this. Oh, welcome to Special Activities Division. What just happened? I think my retirement just got postponed. That's what just happened. Again. Special Activities Division? Hell fucking yes! Olivia? Next thing we knew, we were over South America, courtesy of an agency we couldn't officially name, working for a guy who sent units like ours to early graves every day. Technically, our luck was improving. So this Aguirre's gotta be some highly placed CIA spook to be out here solo. Uh-huh. I don't like it. I don't like any of it. Hey, uh, Flynn, right? What's our ETA? Flynn? Mr. Pilot, sir? Come on, dude! Oh, shoot, man, you just hang on, man. I just I lost my smoke, so I, hang on a minute. Fuck Tuesdays, man. I'm get my shit together on a Tuesday. When are we gonna get there? Couple of minutes. Whoa, how about that? Oh, RPG! RPG! Yeah, I saw it. Whoa, what the fuck? Now, you see these cheap Russian RPGs? They're easy, man. Was like a javelin, I have to do something really tricky. Can you just get us to the fucking LZ before I have to do something real tricky too? Right, right. You got it, boss. Man, this is Ghost Rider reconfirming insert 6449er. Two bodies. That's it. We're wasting our time. No, wait, wait, wait. Jesus Christ, the guy is fucking dead. We're gonna get pinned down waiting for CSI New Jersey here to tell us what we already know. Aguirre is still alive. They would have taken these bodies otherwise. Hmm. Yeah, it's a clue. Aguirre must have left it. Matches right there. Fits right to the grid. We gotta go up river. All right. Call Flynn. Flynn's gone, Hags. This just gets better and better, don't it? Uh, we got company.
Major Aguirre. Gun. Damn. No problem. We're square. Sir, Braidwood sent us. We have something to show you. All right, then show it to me. Braidwood said it was a fake. Yeah, of course it's a fake. I told him it'd be a fake, Christ. They wouldn't just move the actual weapon there. We knew that already. We did? Hags. All right, so a couple of months back, we set up a relay off an old French weather satellite, hook into this Georgian millnet. Found out plenty. The dummy weapon was just part of it. Then these guys showed up. They got all your intel? Yeah. No backups? Where? The satellite controls are in the Andes. Aguirre said we could bring it down. In theory. Okay, boys, you just lay down some fire on those targets over there. All right, Marlo, Hager, get on those miniguns and start firing. Ain't you gonna help us, Flynn? What, me? No way, man, I'm a pacifist. What? Pacifist? How can you be a goddamn pacifist? Yeah, it's bad for my karma, man. Don't mess with karma, I just fly. Hags, let it go. Fuck that! That'll fly with me, Space Muffin! I'm gonna argue you to the goddamn Magic Kingdom! Love you, man! You silly goddamn puppet headed fucking liberal! Done. We should be able to see it any minute now. Luckily, this thing's mostly broken as is and real easy to hack. Yeah. God bless the French. Okay. Now we need to get the data server from inside that thing. Scalar weapon. Beautiful, isn't it? But you can't be serious. You never heard of Operation Aurora? Well, yeah, I have, but look, even if you could produce a Scalar field. At first, to be a localized Carrington event in the troposphere. Stop, stop, stop. In English. All right, a Scalar weapon creates very powerful electromagnetic pulses. So? So they trigger it in the right spot, down goes the U.S. power grid. Then as our fine country slips into total fucking anarchy, the Russians decide to come knocking. The end. So we better find this guy. Arkady Kirilenko. Shit. Ain't that the fella you didn't shoot? He's connected to this project? Kirilenko is the project, but we move this second or he's gone. 
I should clear this with Braid Wood. No, 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 no. He'll just send some special ops douchebags with pussy ass heartbeat monitors on their guns instead of us. Sarge? Man, I'm 44 years old. I got you three bastard kids to look after, a career going nowhere. This was supposed to be my last goddamn mission. I can't do this again. I just can't. What about saving the U.S.? And then what? That's all. Okay, so your end. Kirilenko still breathing is my fault. Sweets? Let me think about it. Yes! Haggard. Hell. I'm not ready to make nice. And I'm not ready to back down. I'm in. All right, here it is. You're gonna piggyback on a U.S. armored op in the area to get to Kirilenko. It's the only way. So we went south, toward Chile. I guess Aguirre had some friends in high places, because there were U.S. tanks waiting for us. We hadn't had support in a long time, so it felt a little like Christmas. Except our present was a crazy Russian colonel. Truth is, I'd had worse holidays. Bravo 2, this is River Guard. Come in, over. Go ahead, River Guard. Kirilenko's last known position puts him in a settlement, possibly a compound, near the Talonet wind farms. Do whatever you can to take him alive. But you know the drill. Do what you have to do. Understood, River Guard. Bravo 2, out. Kodiak 3, we're changing routes. Welcome to the Red Zone. Yeah, it's some really interesting shit on him. Cell phone, bunch of calling cards, 50 grand in U.S. currency. But that ain't the good part. He says he knows who Kirilenko is, and he says he'll tell us if we let him go. All right, give us a few seconds, huh? Hey, how long you wreck? Ten seconds. Four. Five. Four. Bingo. Rally up, fellas. Okay, I've got Kirilenko's location. Marines, we're gonna need your Humvees and your shooters. Whatever you need, sir. What'd you say to that prisoner, Sergeant? Nothing. Just tell him why we were here. He just gave it up. Yep. Said he had family in Houston. Taxi. Sometimes people are just people, man. Mount up. See, you have the orders to take me alive. Yeah. Thank you. Shoot him if he moves. <laughs> Always the same thing. I beg your pardon? You say, shoot him if he moves, but you will not. You should admit the truth of this situation. Now, the situation is, we got all the guns. Sarge, it's a shipping manifest, the Sangre de Toro. So who sent you? Uh, we need to go now, as opposed to later? Aguaya sent you, didn't he? He's a clever adversary, you know. A fine move to capture me here. Sarge! Adversary. He's played well to get this far. So have you. I grant you that. Give me a 
smoke, huh? I'm parched. Sweet Jesus, you crazy fucking hippie! Ghost right here, never fear. I told you, we don't know if he's dead. Let's hope he is. Otherwise... Otherwise, how about you tell us about the ship? The Sangre de Toro was a Panama-registered freighter. Went missing at 49 off the coast of Peru. And you have no idea why he wanted it or what was on it or how it wound up in the desert? No, I don't. But if he wants it, so do we. Good luck. Hey, I think I got a solution. Roger that. Haggard. So there I was, in a ship that was supposed to be lost, looking for something that should have stayed buried. I had my reasons. We all did. Going home. Then I found it. And everything changed. Aurora thing? I think I just found part of it. What? What? Yeah, baby. Sons, sons, give me the comm. Okay, Preston, go. No, wait, I'm, I'm passing in Aguaya too. Okay. Yeah. Oh. It looks like we knew the Japanese had scalar tech as early as 43. This Operation Aurora was a, was a suicide mission. We sent these guys in to die. All of them. Wyatt, Faraday. Wyatt? They knew? Yeah. They even had projected unit casualties. I guess they needed to know what the weapon would do. Wait. Run this code. Sierra Foxtrot 1079er. That's a US military prefix, but nothing even our clearance could reference. How, how much? Hard to say. Just the one. Just take it and get out ASAP. This area is too hot. We're pulling all our operatives out. Solid copy. Things were really heating up with the Russians putting on the pressure. We went north to meet Aguirre so we could get the hell out. We almost made it, too. It don't look very important, does it? Yeah, well, that's how it is. Remember, Troy fell because of a woman. Okay, all right. Troy! Ilya! Hell of a book! Point is, we got it. We gotta get this to Aguirre pronto. Yeah. I don't know about this guy, you know? You find anything on him back at the console? He's a spook! Nothing makes sense! He's coming! It's a javelin! I'm gonna put it down! Come on, bro! There's no time for heroic! Go on, man! Get going! Got it. But I 
Our pilot's been captured. We're not leaving without him. Bravo 2, you're coming in broken and stupid. We need the compound. We'll send an extract team for the pilot. The compound? How do you know it's a compound? You said you didn't know what was on that ship. Bravo 2, just deliver it to my grid. We don't have time for this no one gets left behind hip hip hooray bullshit. You have the coordinates. Do your fucking job. So what are we gonna do now? Damn it, somebody say something! Well, I think it's time to go and rescue us and call me Pinko Liberal Pilot called My Friend. Haggard, for once, I completely agree with you. I thought you were a pacifist. Sometimes even the Buddha had to kick a little ass. Ah, hey. Oh, that's good. Right, you got it under control, Atz. Oh, here you go. Wow. That is... That is righteous, man. They will give you cancer, though. I, I don't know how you're planning to get out of here. There was a, a base on the way down here, choppers full of them, so... Right, well, let's roll. Here's your shit. Now tell us what's going on. You tell me. This was a con? My friend is a very dedicated man. You see, for years, he was my rival in the quest for the weapon. No longer. Why? Because they lied to me. Who? Who lied to you? Who lied to me? Yes. What does it matter? Because I did a little digging on you. Nothing interesting. And then you went all loopy when you heard the name Thomas Wyatt. Now, he had a son, James, about your age. Stop me if this rings any bells. Your father was the commando, Thomas Wyatt. And I think when you found out your government got him killed, you flipped. The government, they lied, didn't they? I had forgiven everything. Until I heard they knew about the weapon. Until then. That's why this country needs to be erased. You're fucking nuts. You can't just destroy a nation for payback. I can't. No. But he can. I could go. So, what now, Sarge? We just put the final piece of the weapon in their goddamn hands. I don't know. We have a change of plans. The Russian colonel is moving to the harbor. We cannot find the American. Be vigilant. Marlo, take him down. I got this one, Sarge. Ain't that the 
plane we saw before. Why are they getting on? Oh, wait, wait, wait. What, why is the plane glowing? Oh, no, 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 no! Get down! I think they just test fired the weapon. The Scalar weapon must be on the plane. Uh, I don't want to do this. Yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of inclined to agree with Haggard. What the hell is wrong with you? Preston! We're out of our league. I think we ought to go! Go? Go where? Home? There won't be a home! Won't be anything! Sweetwater, that's it? Guess you really weren't cut out for the special ops after all. The shit hits the fan, and you want out! Sarge, you just gonna lay down? I see. Fine. I'll go my fucking self. No, Preston, you won't. And you too. You listen to Marlowe and you listen good. Come on now. Sweets, this is interesting stuff, man. Don't you want to know how this ends? You had me at interesting. Hags, come on now. If you leave, no more T-Bone steaks, man. Yeah, no more buying AR-15 ammo at the mall. No more shooting trespasses on your porch. No more biscuits and gravy. No more Super Bowl Sundays. No more Dallas Cowboys cheerleaders? Shit. That's tour. Get out of the way! I gotta save me some cheerleaders. So how you doing? You look good. <laughs> That's real funny, Marlo. If we don't die out here, I'm fixing on skinning you like a deer. Hey, 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 the plane's moving! Look at the size of that thing! That's an AN-225. Mira means dream. It's an enlarged version of the AN-124. Biggest ever built can carry 253 tons of equipment. What? I can know stuff. Shouldn't the weapon have killed the plane too? Yeah. Seems like Ground Zero is safe with scalar weapons, but outside it... Well, anyway, I don't think we can knock that thing down. So who wants to hijack a plane? It was a long night, waiting, planning. But that thing about always darkest before the dawn, sometimes you just need to turn on a light. Where the hell is Q 
Kirilenko. We're about 130 clicks outside of Texas, closing fast. Sarge, we are out of time. Gentlemen, all the compound you have given me will shield us from the blast. Oh, and for that, I am very grateful. Enjoy. It's not entirely true we couldn't get into the weapons room, is it? Well, no, but... Ah, fuck it already. Retirement would have been born anyway. You are too late. We are nearly at zero point. I don't think so. Do it. What? What are you doing? Get back, boys. Hey, it's your time. Home sweet home! Okay, okay, okay. I guess I had to visit sooner or later. Oh man, what are we gonna do now? Sarge? You ain't saying much. Oh, I think you gotta ask Marlo here. Thanks to him, I'm officially retired. Yeah, hell of a job, Marlo. Me? Ha, <laughs> shucks, sweets. What about you? Oh, I don't know. It was cool, but, you know, this special ops shit, not my style. Well, now we need to party, and I know an establishment you're gonna love. There's this girl called Chantel, and she can scrap any Tid. Hut. Gentlemen! Sir! At ease. You have the heartfelt thanks of the United States government. Now, I'm sorry as hell to say this, but I need you all to come with me. But why, sir? The Russians. They're invading. Uh, sir! No, they're not, sir. Uh, we just blew up that fucking ultimate weapon of theirs. P.S. Invasion canceled, sir. Not here. They're coming in through Alaska. Alaska? There are times it sucks to be right. <laughs> <laughs> 